This is Jack Rice on the campaign trail. And the votes are in in the Iowa caucuses. On the Republican side, Mike Huckabee has won 34% to Mitt Romney's 25%. On the Democratic side, Barack Obama's 38% takes him into the lead over John Edwards' 31 and Hillary Clinton's 29%. If we look at the Republicans first, this is going to be a huge challenge for Mike Huckabee to continue his winning streak for one simple reason. He does not have the structure on a national stage to compete with Mitt Romney. At the same time, Mitt Romney needed to win in Iowa, so this may weaken him dramatically. In addition to that, John McCain is now surging, may have an impact upon this race. We now turn to the Democrats, and Hillary Clinton's third-place win says a lot more. She was the anointed one. Many expected her to walk away. Now she may not be able to do this, and she must win New Hampshire. If she doesn't, we then turn to South Carolina, where 50% of the vote is African American. American, no guarantees for Barack Obama, but there is a huge question mark on the anointed one's campaign. John Edwards, on the other hand, really has no national campaign. So what we're probably going to see in New Hampshire is the fight between Barack Obama, who can take this and springboard this into a national campaign, and Hillary Clinton trying to convince those who anointed her that they were right in the first place. This is Jack Rice on the campaign trail.